Next example, we have the sum of the squares of three numbers to be 138, while the sum of their products taken two at a time is 131. So what will be the sum? Let us see the options. Option A, 20, B, 30. C 40 and D as none of these. Let the numbers be A, B and C as we assume. So the sum of the squares of the three numbers is given to be 138. So the square of each number and you have to sum it that is A square, B square and C square. Summation is A square plus B square plus C square to be 138. And the sum of their products taken two at a time is nothing but A into B plus B into C plus C into A to be 131. By using the formula A plus B plus C the whole square is equal to A square plus B square plus C square plus 2 into AB plus BC plus CA. Simply you have to substitute your value of 138 over here and 131 over here. 138 plus 2 into 131 is equal to 138 plus 262 which is nothing but 400. So A plus B plus C the whole square is equal to 400 hence a plus B plus C will be nothing but square root of 400 which is equal to 20. Hence, your answer is option A, 20. Well, this is an important question as it has appeared in GATE, GRE, SSC and IBPS. The product of two numbers is given to be 120. Now next example. And the sum of the squares is given to be 289. What will be the sum of the number? Let us see the options. Option A 20, Option B 23, Option C 169 and Option D None of these. Well, this is an important question. As you can see, it has appeared in Bank Exam, Saskan and HCL. It is given that the product of two numbers to be 120. So, if you are considering your numbers to be X and Y, so the product of the number is nothing but XY that is equal to 120. And it is given that sum of the squares is 289. So, sum of the squares is nothing but x square plus y square is nothing but 289. As we know, the formula for x plus y, the whole square, is equal to x square plus y square plus 2xy. Substitute your value over here, 289 plus 2 into 120 that gives you 529 therefore x plus y is equal to square root of 529 23 into 23 is 529 hence square root of 529 is nothing but 23 hence option b 23 is your answer Thank you so much. Hope you had fun learning with GTEC.